What's up everybody, Caleb here, and today I'm going to go through what I have just picked up at Walmart. It's the Friday the 13th Deluxe Edition Collection. I've been trying forever to actually find the box set of these on eBay or Amazon, wherever, but I don't make a lot of money, so, and they're all very overly priced, and it's, um, there's only 50,000 of them in the whole world. It comes with a... Uh, collector's edition mask, and it's in a digi book and everything, and it's a uh, it's a really awesome collection. It's these same movies, the first eight Friday Thirteenth movies. So you know, if I come across one that's reasonably priced, I probably will pick it up. But for right now, this is what's going to get me through having the deluxe editions. They're all still in the shrink wrap, so we're going to open each one of them up and go through and talk about what all special features are on these. My, uh, if you've watched my original Friday the 13th uh, collection video, you'll see that uh, my collection has definitely needed updated, so I think this is, uh, this is a good start to update. So first off, Friday the 13th Uncut, the Deluxe Edition. The back right there. Uh, the special features here are commentary by director Sean S. Cunningham, the cast and crew, fresh cuts. New Tales from Friday the 13th, The Man Behind the Legacy, Sean Cunningham, A Friday the 13th Reunion, and Lost Tales from Camp Blood Part 1, and of course, Death the Trailer. Let's take the shrink wrap off here. This might take a minute or two. I don't want to use my teeth. <laughs> I'm familiar with your C minor. Yeah. Let's see what's inside. Just the disc. Nothing fancy on the inside. Next up, Friday the 13th Part 2, the Deluxe Edition. Cover for Part 1, I do like that. You know, it's, it's pretty much the same as uh, the original one, except for there's no, um, you know, everyone knows what the original cover looks like. You know, it has the camp and the kids and the outline of Mrs. Lori's body. And this one, of course, is the outline of Jason's body, of course, with the axe original. And, uh, different there, the back of it. These have been out for a few years. I think these came out around the time that the uh, remake was coming out in 2009. Special features inside Crystal Lake Memories, Friday's Legacy Horror Conventions, Lost Tales from Campbell Part 2, Jason Forever, and the actual trailer. I'm trying to grab this bad boy. That one. When these first came out, they all had slip covers that were a 3D seismic, is what they call it. You know, force made it that way. Friday the 13th, Part 3 in 3D. This is the one I'm really excited about because I've been wanting to watch this movie in 3D for quite some time. It's DVD 3D, but it's good enough for me. I'm happy with that. Includes a 3D version of the film with their 3D glasses. Let's check that out. Okay. Okay, so two pairs of 3D glasses. That's cool. 3D glasses. Nothing special about them. I know the ones that come with the box that actually look like the outline of Jason's eyes from the hockey mask. That's kind of disappointing, I must say. All these are eco friendly. Friday the 13th, the final chapter, Deluxe Edition. Back of it. Special features, commentary by director Joe Zito, screenwriter Barry Cohen, and editor John Goodman. Fan commentary by Adam Green and Joe Lynch. Lost Tales from Camp Blood Part 
4 slash scenes, Jason's unlucky day, 25 years after Friday the 13th final chapter, the lost ending, the Crystal Lake Massacre revisited part 1, Jimmy's dead dance moves, original theatrical trailer. These special features are really what I'm excited about for these because it's a uh, it's deluxe, basically. Um, there was a collection that came out, um, I think it was in 2004. It was called from Crystal Lake to Manhattan. And it had a pretty cool bonus features disc. But I'm pretty sure that all these special features are new and not the same. So that's what I'm really excited about. That's the special features that's coming along with these. Next up, Friday the 13th Part 5, A New Beginning. If you watched my original Friday the 13th Collection DVD, I talked about which one's my favorite, and this one is my favorite. Shockingly, people are shocked to find that out, I think, because Jason's not the killer in this one, it's a copycat. But I just, this movie's filled with a lot of great horror humor and great killing scenes, I think. And he, I mean, he kills a lot of people in this one. <laughs> he really does. Compared, I mean, there's a lot of deaths in this movie compared to some of the other ones. Commentary by director, co-screenwriter Danny Steinman and James Crew. Lost Tales from Camp Local 5, The Crystal Lake Massacre Revisited Part 2, New Beginning, The Making of Friday 13, Part 5, A New Beginning, and Original Theatrical Trip. Okay. Next up, Friday 13, Part 6. Jason lives. I gotta tell you, I'm not really excited about this cover. I mean, Jason on the front looks doesn't really look like the Jason that we know from this movie. Um, it looks more like the copycat from Part Five. The paramedic in the mask is not what he wears, as you can tell. If you can, I don't think you can see it really good on here. But if you have a chance to pull this up on the internet, or if you have it, the mask has the two triangular lines on it, and that's not the good mask that he wears in this one. My third favorite of the series, if you remember from my first video. Commentary by director Tom McLaughlin, the cast and crew, Lost Tales from Camp Blue Part 6, The Crystal Lake Massacre Revisited Part 3, Jason Lives, The Making of Friday 13, Part 6, Meeting Mr. Voorhees, I'm not sure what that is, I'm playing the nurse, just check that out, Slash Scenes, and Original Theatrical Teaser Trailer. I think I missed this. Two more to go. Friday the 13th, part 7, the New Blood Deluxe Edition. Again, cover. That's definitely not Kane Hodder. <laughs> definitely not Kane Hodder, Jason. That's for sure. Killer commentary by director John Carl Buckler and actors Laura Park Lincoln and Kane Hodder. Jason's Destroyer, The Making of Friday 13 Part 7, The New Blood, Slash Scenes Intro, Slash Scenes, Mind Over Matter, The Truth About Telekinesis, Telekinesis, Makeover by Maddie, Need a Little Touch Up Work by My Ass. <laughs> I finally got the thing on with the shrink wrap off. <laughs> and there's the disc. One more. Friday the 13th, part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan. Second favorite of the series. I love this one. This one's really underrated. A lot of people don't like it. But personally, this is one of my all time favorites of the series. Killer commentary by actors Scott Reeves, Jensen Daggett, and Kane Hodder. I'm interested to hear that, you know, especially because of the the, the, the guy and the girl in the film, uh, Rennie and uh, I never came out of the guy's name. <laughs> and Kane Hodder, of course. New York has a new problem: the making of Friday Thirty Part Eight. This is Manhattan slash scenes and a gag reel. Well, if you want to hear about the lecture, I'm telling you about it or what. And there's the Alright, that is the Friday the 13th Deluxe Edition collection, parts 1 through 8.
interested to watch some of these, the special features, and see what they all have to offer, and also watch the uncut unrated version of the first one, if you're interested to see how that is. Alright, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.